All new at 6, finding free parking in one of our Bay Area towns will soon be a lot more difficult. As ABC Action News reporter J.J. Burton explains tonight, Treasure Island city leaders voting to spend more than $40,000 to add more metered parking. Right now, there are 430 meter parking spaces on Treasure Island, but more are coming. I think it's ridiculous. City commissioners unanimously voted to put meters at this beach access on 127th Avenue, 102nd Avenue, 101st Avenue, and Kingfish Drive. Makes no sense. Kingfish Drive is usually packed with people who park here because it's close to the beach, the businesses, and restaurants. Some come down here to go fishing, and many, like Phil Henry, park here to go to work. I've enjoyed the walk and the beauty of what I see every day. You know, it makes me thankful that I'm down here. Phil works in John Pass Village, where he has to pay to park. If I work 200 days a year, that's roughly $5 a day of parking, so I've saved $1,000. Phil is going to park in the garage now that the meters are coming. He says, though, it also comes with another headache. And I could be in that parking garage for 45 minutes just getting out because each car is in, has to stop individually, so I'm going to have to pack some more patience with me. Some business owners aren't happy about it either. They fear they'll lose some business. The city leaders say this will help deal with the overcrowding concerns and minimize safety and liability issues. Yeah, no, that's a joke. How, how, how much more safe can you get? On Treasure Island, J.J. Burton, ABC, Action News.